What's up guys, Zor here, and I'm back with another Feed the Beast tutorial. Uh, so if you've been watching my Let's Play on this, you'll notice, or you'll have seen that I tried to make a quarry, I needed titanium, uh, which is the hardest thing to build, um, so I, I decided to show everybody how to do it. And I just realised the mistake that I made in this, so I'll quickly fix this, and I'll explain what I'm doing in a second. Um, so, there is no... Um, like ore or anything for titanium if you're looking for it and um, you have to make it from scratch so the first thing you have to do is get bauxite dust and um, which comes from bauxite ore if you could not guess which is this stuff here so you can make that in a pulverizer and um, or a macerator either way I'll just stick something here uh, I've automated all this but you don't need to it's just for the sake of speed Alright, so you, you macerate that and you get four bauxite dust. Um, it's in a macerator or a pulverizer, either one does it, you just take it out there. Um, then you stick it into an industrial electrolyzer. That is quite hard to make. Um, here's like the recipe. You can get it from your not enough items. Uh, it'll be easier that way. Um, and you put your bauxite dust in with cells. So just these empty cells stick them in this bit here, it needs to be powered um, this macerator needs uh, transform upgrades if you want to run it on medium voltage which is what this runs on um, same as that so I've got a medium voltage transformer there um, so that we have to wait ages because it takes a long time this is a very lengthy process um, again this is all just for ease of like making it um, it's not that expensive to automate it's not the most used thing so you might not need to but if you do you just it's pretty standard uh, to do so once this is done I'll actually just turn this off so I can catch it before it gets sucked out to hurry up I think it's you need eight cells and I can't remember how much box I think it's eight box eight um, pair like lot so it's quite expensive but bauxite is, has no real use I've not found any use for it um, and you get a lot of it quite quickly so it's not that big of a deal uh, hurry up come on it's taking its time almost there like two more pixels one more pixel come on come on Come on! And done! Almost. Right, so yeah, as you can see, this is the longest thing ever. Right, almost there? Come on. Right, okay. So, once that's done, you get 8 aluminium dust, which is kind of useful. A hydrogen cell, no idea what it does. You can use it for gas turbines or liquid fueled fireboxes. Compressed air cell, no idea what that does. And this is what you're really wanting, is two tiny piles of titanium dust. Now what you do with this is you set it up like this into a four, like you do with any. So if you just take, you just take your tiny piles and go one, two, three, four, and you get this titanium dust. Um, so that was what, that would just get sucked out here. And then you come to this. This is an industrial blast furnace, and you stick that in there. Um, now the thing with the industrial blast furnace is I'll actually make it for you is this thing. So what you need to do is grab the, the unit itself which is built like this incredibly hard to build uh, not hard it's, none of this stuff is that that expensive um, like these are kind of expensive, they're alright that's a bit expensive, these are fairly expensive. Once you've got enough ingots and stuff it's fine, it just takes ages to build um, what you also have to do is you have to get standard machine casings, these are expensive, you need um, a certain amount of these, 1, 9, um, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24 of the standard ones and 9 of the reinforced ones. So those reinforced ones are built with steel and other stuff, you can use your not enough items. What you have to do is this with this in the middle. You go one, two, three, 
uh, and you build a 3x3 three three grid in the bottom. You build up to here, up to there, uh, sorry, on the each side, like so. Okay, so you got the two hollow bits in the middle hollow. Um, this is the cheapest way of doing it. You can use it all reinforced if you want, if you're going to use this for other stuff, um, but this is the cheapest way. Next, you want to fill the hollow part with lava and put this 9x9 nine nine on top. Um, up there, and then that's you built your industrial blast furnace. This thing shows you some stuff like the way it's that's the way it's set out now, I think, and um, with lava in the middle. So it's got flat, lava, lava, top. Or sorry, that is the bottom because that's the wee green bit for this guy. And uh, that just takes power, EU power. Uh, if you want to automate it, it goes in from the top, and you get your titanium and gets there. So, yeah, that's how you make titanium. Incredibly expensive, incredibly complicated. If you're wondering what this is, this is just power. Uh, obviously, I'm in creative, so I just spammed a bunch of solar panels and MFSUs and stuff. It doesn't take that much power. That was just for ease. Um, like these are all got upgrades and stuff, but you could probably run it. Th this dude needs 120 out, or sorry, input. 120 EUs a tick. So just consider that because if you don't have enough, then it won't work. Um, and yeah, that's probably everything I have to say. Uh, so thanks for watching guys, if you enjoyed it, make sure to hit that like. Go and make some titanium in your own world and you can make a quarry with it, that's probably the main use for it. Uh, as well as a diamond drill I think you use it for maybe. I cannot remember. Um, anyway, thanks for watching, if you want to see more stuff like this, subscribe, make sure to like this video, it helps me out a lot. Uh, Favourite if you really liked it and you want to remember what it is. and. Just as it goes dark, I will say goodbye. So see you later, guys.